white wall tires uh, won't drive in mud. They're not winter tires, they're just regular. You'll be fine once the ground, yeah. you don't want to get in the mud anyways, do you? Or well, do you? the winter tires that I took off, they were just soft. Like I thought they were bald, but no sir, the tread's just like new, but it was full of mud. Gotcha. And it wouldn't go anywhere unless I had like momentum. Yeah, you got a nice spot here, Jimbo. Beautiful. Ooh, what do you got? You got staging? Um, oh, that's just an old ladder. Yes, I got staging. It's in front of the house. Oh, wow. Every once in a while, some shingles blow off. I got to go yeah. patch it. What's the plan? Um, move. Not really too much. Um, I, see, I see you got I don't, some... I feel semi accident prone and a little wild so I don't really want to drive out in the yard any. Semi accident prone he said. Your poor wall. You know, that, oh, you know what that's all about. <laughs> I was thinking we're going to come out here today. I hope we're not playing bumper cars. Are we playing bumper cars? No. <laughs> no. 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 Mm -hmm. We could be but. Do you have a seat for this car? A what? A seat. Yeah. Did you want to back the bad boy out? Um, I'll pump the gas a few times see if it'll fire up. I'd stand out of the way, sweetheart. We don't want no bumper cars on you. No bumper cars on you. Boy, this thing's going right back where she was found. Right in the ground. I, um, it's easier to just dump a little carb, gas in the carb. We can just push it or you want to push it neutral? Um, oh, I want to hear it run anyway. Okay. Getting anxious to get the Ferrari out? Yes, I am, but I, I wish the roads were a smidgen. Better. Some of the potholes are getting fixed up. Yeah. Some of well, there's there's a couple of good roads around. Yeah. I've noticed they're working on it. They're trying the best they can, no doubt in my mind. Oh, I better put that in something. <sighs> I put a choke on it, but it it never it it doesn't seem to ever pick it up. And when you pump the gas, I know it gets squirts of gas, but it doesn't seem to work. So maybe it's because it sits for a month. I've never done the steering wheel trick, but that is oh. rough, isn't it? You've never done it? Well, we're going to do it today, aren't we? I've never done it before. Oh, I thought you uh, were talking from experience. No, I was talking from... <laughs> no, no, not at all. <laughs> Something new. Man, what a beautiful day. <clears throat> Do that again. <clears throat> So once you get that up there on that on that landing, you'll be able to get your Ferrari out. Um, yeah, this it's going to take me a while. Oh, yeah. to get the brakes done. Yeah, um, I'm going to call you up every no day. No need. See if you like, get it done yet. By the time I get the brakes and a little bit of welding done to hold the car together a little yeah. more, um, it'll take me a while, and I have to have this area for the car I drive, like the Ferrari, for instance. And if I take this apart right here. Them white uh, walls are not in bad shape, down. eh? They're not bad shape at all. Not in bad shape at all. 
I think I'll stand in front of you. No, I'll just stand right here. I'm not going up behind you. You're just going straight back anyways. Oh, I had it here. <laughs> you plan, plan on playing bumper cars. Do you want me to dump some gas in it? Um, yeah, a little bit. Maybe it's not picking up. Where's this? Can I just pour right down the center of the breather? Uh, the or front part. Not much. We'll give you enough to, to flutter. Come on now, gas jug. Yeah, just... Just a little kitty yeah, lick? Two or three spoonfuls. I'm going to stand to the side of this bad boy. And the reason being... Do I, you want me to take the top of the breather off, I take it? Yeah, you pretty well have to. Well, I sometimes dump her down the... Go ahead, try it. Just a second. Just a second. Please. Just a second. Go ahead. Um, it should be picking up gas by now. Well, it might not. How long has it been before it's running? No, Try it, again. It, it should be picking up gas by now. But it isn't. Give her a couple stomps on the accelerator. Just a second. Yeah, not running very good, is it? Well, not right the second, it isn't. No. But any time in the past, it's always picked it up. Is it, it out of gas? It. No, the jug's quite hit, quite heavy. Just a second. Try that. No, it's not getting get it's not picking up its gas. Maybe my hose is not down in your gas? Well, it should be. Did you want to try it again, or you want yeah, me to stop yeah, a minute? Yep. Yeah, I just bent the pipe. It goes down in. Lots of gas now. Try it again? Yep. Um... I just bent the copper pipe in the gas jug a little bit. It must. Do you have want been up this back on or just leave yeah. it off for now? No, put it back on. Anyway, it must not have been picking up. It's not a full jug of gas in here. It must have just been covering on the top. I'm just going to set the hood down. Yeah, it must have been that line going into the gas jug was yeah. up in... This. Watch your door when you back out, oh, you want yeah. that door shut. And you just want to go straight back. Uh, everybody's out of the way. Everybody's out of the way, right? Out of the way, baby! <clears throat> You're good, just straight back, Jimbo. Perfect. I hope he didn't hit that tree. <laughs> that thing looks good, don't it? Huh? I think it's badass. 
Oh. All right. I think it's good. You're a scary man. Don't put it in a ditch, Jimbo. He's a maniac, <laughs> maniac, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh. Did you have fun? Um, yeah, it doesn't have much traction. <laughs> no, I don't know. <laughs> just burn. <laughs> Sounds good, though. Um, that's like just playing with the gas pedal. I don't kick in the four barrels or anything. No. Yeah, no sense. You got some body fill? Uh, yep. What we're, yep. What, what we're planning on doing is Jimbo steering wheels all chewed up. I I, pu I put uh, super glue all through the cracks to hold the pieces because everything's floating. Yeah. And I just want to put a coat out over it. So what we're going to do is um, this is a, I sanded it some. It's yeah. still got a couple shiny spots, but I did this sand it some. This is kind of a trick. I guess I don't say a trick, but if someone had a, a rotten sill on their car and you didn't want to weld the metal in it, you lay a couple pieces of strips of tape down, mix up some fiberglass, and take your fiberglass and coat the tape. One end would, one guy would grab that end, I'd grab this end, we'd flop the tape up on the car and push it on, then the fiberglass would go on the sill to hold it, you know, just a gum up job. But we plan on doing the exact same thing. We got some saran, okay. what is the paper called? Body metal. Some wax paper so the body fill don't stick to it. And we're going to mix them up, make a line of body fill. And then we'll take the wax paper and put it around the, the steering wheel. And Jimbo will have to sand it to make it to what he desires. But to put body fill on that steering wheel and have it fall on the, on the floor and make sort of a mess. We'll try to contain it a little bit. So we'll mix some up, put it in on this ram wrap. I guess you wax paper, sorry, excuse me, wax paper. I, I, us I usually don't do tricks like this, but we're going to try it, see what happens. What's that, sweetheart? You're going to check your mic there, Jimbo. Oh. Yeah. And the wax paper is where, Jimbo? Uh, in that box. Can we mix it right over here? Right no, this, this box. Yeah, I got it. Oh, okay. Yeah, I got it. I just want to mix it on something, right? Oh, no, I, I got that. Right here. Okay. <laughs> He's all set. Okay, my... Body fill scoopers. Where sure did I there. put them? Oh, the yep, there. yep. I um, don't have a big selection. Oh, there's don't matter. a piece of 80 grit. That's a little fine, but I don't have a big selection of uh, coarse. I got some for you. Oh, wait a minute. No, I do. Right there. Yeah, I yeah. got some for you. 
You ain't got any? Yeah, but sandpaper. Uh, I yep. just found That's, some. I didn't know I had that. That's what I was talking about. I got some for you if you want it. I'm thinking that the body fill won't stick to the wax paper. Um, well, there's that part. Boy, it's nothing like having your shop not very well organized. That's all right, man. When you change, like when I work on one thing, hey. everything's right there in front of me. But when I hey. go and do something we'll, we'll, else, we'll just, oh my Lord, we'll, we'll everything's just, upside down. We'll just dump it out. I wouldn't stick it like that. Just take it and do this. Just dump it like that and then cut it off when you got enough. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. 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 I can show you if you like. Uh, oh, Instead of getting all um, body filly. Yeah, no, just a second. It's, we got um, all the liquid on top. Well, that's good and stuff, I've learned the hard way. Always stir your material. Yeah. Especially primer. Yeah, oh, that's for sure. Yeah. Mm. Anyway, there's a couple of little spatulas. So this is, what, this is what we plan on doing, Jimbo. We'll lay this out. Oh, we don't need spatulas. Well, we well, do for kind of mixing, but not And really. we're going to let put a line of body fill on this. Okay. And then we're going to put it on the steering wheel, and then we can take this wax paper and, and put it on the steering wheel, and then we can put our hands around it, try to get it to look half decent before you have to sand it. Um, That's what I'm thinking. And if it don't work... Well, how much? That much try, trial at the beginning? No, way more than that. Way more than that? Ooh. <laughs> Jeez, you've got guts. <laughs> well, we can yeah, always that, mix that's up good, more. Yeah, that's good. So basically, I'm going to do this, Jimbo. Uh, I'm going to grab this that, if you don't mind. That steering wheel, I got it mostly sanded. Oh, yeah. Um, you just want body fill on the whole thing. Yeah, so but it, it it's got gloss, the original gloss, and it's flaky. Yeah. So I got it mostly sanded, but it's not actually sanded, sanded. Like uh, get off the loose and the shiny stuff that from the original. Okay. It should be uh, gone over a little tiny bit. Oh, I hate to use this brand new. Well, that's what it's for. Yeah, but uh, the steering wheel is not worth, like, that's worth more than the. Well, I got some stuff over there you can have then. I got some used stuff. I'll give it to you in the shop. Not today, but you. Uh, look at that. There's a piece there, probably do it. Yeah, okay, that's better. You have um, that? Okay. Well. Don't put like uh, a, a big amount of hardener in it, just because oh, we're going. Oh, it's kind of cool. We're going outside. It's going to be. Oh, there it is. Good. This is a new procedure for me, but I think it will work. Oh, we should scuff off that sand, that steering wheel just a little tiny bit because there it does it does have some shiny spots on it. Well, and to the be body fill won't you. stick to the shiny and the loose stuff. Once you get that wrapped all the way around there. It's, yeah. I have to find it hard to be um, going anywhere. Oh, take this. Just give it a light scuff wherever you see shiny or loose or flaky. Because I sanded it some, but I didn't sand it. Well, uh, that would be the whole wheel. I, I, I only got three quarters of it done. Like once that body fill goes in them crevices, Jim, she's not going nowhere, buddy. That stuff's just falling off like glue. You know what I mean? Once it goes in them places and then all them cracks and stuff, it's not going nowhere. Like that stuff. I realize they said there's shiny places on not many shiny places on it, but whatever. We'll do as he asks. How's that? We'll do as he asks. didn't he? Um, I don't up. know if you do it like this. I uh, very carefully circle it and work it back and forth. Yeah. So I don't put air pinholes in it. Before you it takes get, off. Oh no, it's, I'm still mixing it. I understand that, but you're going to have to hurt here. 
but if you go like this, yeah. you put air, you put air bubbles in it, which makes pinholes. You go like that, you never have, you don't have as many pinholes if you're careful. But when you go, when you like I do it, well, yeah, the way you do it, you fill your body fill full of pinholes. I've been getting pinholes like a lot lately, and I get no pinholes. Hey, put me a line of body fill. Ever like, do do a, do a line. I have other problems though. Do a line okay. of body fill like this. You know what I mean? Put in a line. Oh, like put a line. Ooh, this is terrible stuff. Good stuff it is, Jimbo. Ah, I think. Try to give me a straight line if you can. Well, give put it all on there. Don't get it. Don't get, no. I want it straight. I want a straight oh, line. That's well, all right. that's, all right. that's that's straight enough. That's all right. Yeah, that's good enough. Grab one end. I'm gonna Grab get inside the car. Grab one of this paper. Okay. We're gonna do the bottom. Ah! Oh, terrible, terrible. Got me hooked on again? Yeah. Short my pocket, sweetheart. Oh, there's body fill. Thank okay. you. Uh, don't sit on it. Nope. Okay. I just put it up around the steering wheel like that. Oh, we got too much. That's all right. Too much is, is better than not enough. You're going to sand it, aren't you? Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, that does. Ooh. And it knows to dry inside all that. What's that? The body fill will know to dry inside there. <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Oh, need more wax paper. Yeah. You're going to sand it off so it's nice, are you not? Um, well, yeah, pretty well I have to, don't I? <laughs> now you do. <laughs> Probably more than once. Oh, you're going to have to sand it, that's for sure. Well, the first time when you body fill something, like the first coat, especially on something like this, is going to be real sloppy. Yes. You know, it's it gets better as you do it, but um, this doesn't work very good. No. At all. Your finger would be the best. Yeah. Thing. Well, aren't you going to have fun sanding that all off? Of course, paper. Um, It looks like a hell of a mess. Oh, it is. It I'm, about, is. I'm going to learn something here. I don't know if we both are. How's that, Jimbo? <laughs> I body filled. I made the steering wheel on the old tractor, but I used that plastic thing around and around and around, and it, it was time consuming and messy. But uh, let's pull this off. See if we can wrap it somewhere else on the top. Want to pull this off, Jimbo? Oh, yes. Go easy. See that? Um, okay, you hold it. I'm going to turn the wheel around. Okay. I got her. What do you think of that? Huh? Jimbo, what do you think of that? Not bad, eh? Mm. A little bit more. Watch your, don't get in your body, Phil. There. Let's just do a little bit more. Do it again. I see that body fill down in there better. I'm gonna let's sit here, let's take it off. Oh, I'm gonna scrape this. Yeah, let's take it off and scoop it in like make Okay, a line yes, again. yes. Yes. Nope, let's let it lay it down on the tip um, here. Let's lay it down here. Okay. And you can scrape it in line again. Yeah. See how nice that is up in there? See how nice that went? Uh oh. I ripped the paper. That's alright. The wires underneath don't. How about, how about you just pick it up and get it on your squeegee and give me some? I'll put it on my finger and just wipe it on the car instead of wasting it. Okay. Give, give it to me. Give me that. I don't think we're in a rush. The stuff, I put a little more hardener in it than you said. It's starting to get hard. Okay. It's starting to get hard, and it is. Well, that that's good because it makes it go on easier when it's starting to go hard. 
What'd you say, sweetheart? I missed a bunch of spots. <laughs> I missed a bunch of spots. Well, the several tubes of glue in around holding the uh, plastic to the metal kind of made things solid for this. This is kind of like our finish coat. Watch your hand here. Well, you know, just for the surface. Like this is not to hold the steering wheel together because the glue all in around is holding the glue, holding it sort of together. This is going to give your. This just gives me my handle that doesn't rip the skin off my hand. Christ, you wouldn't want that doing circles, would you? Rip the skin no. off your hands. Oh yeah, you're right. It's hardening. Oh yeah, I'm done. Yep, you're done. You can see how smooth it went on up there, though. Yeah. How nice it was to apply. Oh, I know. It looks real good in a couple spots there. My leg. No, this car is not very good. Although that is awful muddy. It's rained every day for like two weeks. But no, the tires, they don't have any. Steering wheel restoration at its yeah. finest. I don't know if you want to do it again or if you just want to put it on by hand now or mix them up or let that um, dry a little bit. We can do a little bit more. It's just hard uh, where it's I'll stuck. grab, as soon as, in the, as soon as I clean this off, I'll come out and, and give it a light wipe wipe before it really dries. Yeah. It'd be nicer too if you had the steering wheel off and you could go all the way around where we're doing it on here. It's yeah, okay. Nope. Beautiful. So up there on the top is where we saran wrapped it. Up here is where we done the saran wrap and down here is by hand. And you can do it by hand if you want to, but saran wrap just got it wrapped, wrapped all the way around. What's that? Wax. wax paper, saran wrap, sorry, excuse me. I guess it tells you I don't use much wax paper. Is that what it tells you? But that stuff is sharp. I know when we first, before he glued it together, it was sharp. It come off in your hands, hurt your hands. At the door, the door card seen better days. <laughs> She's gonna touch me, boy. She's gonna touch me. Hmm. I'm a lucky man. But it was the gas jug line wasn't down in the gas because as soon yeah. as I bent it and got it right to the bottom, then it started. Then it stayed running. Oh, I, you, I don't know if I stand it. Yeah, it's too soft. Uh, you won't won't hurt it. As long as I don't peel it off. There you go. Jimbo knows. Jimbo knows. I, I've been sanding body fill wet all my life. I don't like the dust. There you go. But you have to be a little careful. Yes. But if you sand it when it's real wet, the highs will fill in the lows. You're not all just good looks, are you, Jimbo? You don't sand it when it's wet on the final body fill on, on a fussy job, though. You know, but when it's the first time, you know, like the first coat. That's when the old cheese grater used to yeah. come in handy. I used to yeah, hate that. Uh, when you the cheese grater, take too much off, you burn it. Yeah. Don't need good paper either. That old saran wrap worked good, didn't it? Yep. That was up there yeah, where it was a lot it. smoother. Although you did good here even with like I just like to get finger. it all the way around, you know what I mean? We didn't get anything in the finger I, know. I don't think. I still have that steering wheel all painted up soon, have new paint on it and everything else, won't you, Jimbo? Um, Probably not. Yep. Yep, he said. Yeah. You tried to get it off, did you not? Uh, it wouldn't come off. Yeah, that's what I heard. It wouldn't come off. We even bent the shaft. 
I had to get the tap and die set and re and fix the threads for the nut to go back. That's on. a very that's a desired steering wheel for a lot of customers. You know what I mean? How it comes out like that in the center. Oh, the point. Well, just how it, how it comes back, how it has the the kick in, I guess. Me and Jolene did some work on the on the 40 Ford. We were doing the floor on that this morning. And then we pop over here. He's getting in, he's getting serious. Uh, well. Getting serious, I Jimbo? I don't want to uh, block the view <laughs> of like my audience, like you and everybody. Oh, you got an audience. Oh, this, this went smooth up here. Oh yeah, went well, didn't like it? Like when we first put that on, yes. We probably could have just mixed some more up and did it again. Yeah. We probably should over what's going on there now. You can see all the finger marks and everything on this side, yeah, can't know. you? It went well, didn't it? But this just gets some of the highs off, so we're not sanding later on. Yeah. Like, plus, we're not waiting. But. We're going to have to ceram that the whole thing, though, to get it in, in all the grooves. You know what I mean? To get it like yeah. that? I think we should. You yeah. shouldn't have any white showing at all to make it last the best. And we don't mess with the rest. It's kind of neat. Uh, you just move the steering wheel to wherever you want to sand and you keep your hand in the same spot. Yeah, put her on her drill and just turn her and hold your hand like a... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Got a little bit of a blob right there. Well, I would have to say that's looking pretty good. Well, it's gonna, it'll work in the end, like yeah. once you get some more on it. Yeah, it needs another coat. Only a couple. <laughs> yeah. We'll do the, the wax paper again, not saran wrap, wax paper again. Yeah, yeah saran. No, wax paper, she keeps telling me, Jimbo, it's wax paper. Yeah, they shouldn't, yeah, exactly. I agree with you one. 100% sweetheart. Wax paper and saran wrap is two different things. Uh, All right, so the body fill, yeah. Okay. Oh. We'll just make a, a, a shorter one. This, this is time. the worst spot, so I'll put that at the bottom. Well, what, what happens is we'll, we'll, we'll actually we'll mix a little bit up, like a like you know a little smaller line, and then I'll do that one, and then you uh, can and, keep some on your board. And we know not to put quite as much on in the blob, we'll just, because we had a, you know we had kind of a mess. What's what I'm saying? You'll keep some on your board, so I'll go. I'll, I'll make a smaller okay. thing, and then I'll do that, and then I'll come back, and you can put some more on with your board from yeah. your board, and I'll do another piece. Oh yes. Yes, yes, yes. If you know what I'm trying uh, to say. With a new piece of paper, leave the paper right there. Ken, yes, yes. That way we're not peeling it off yes. and making, like, it worked good, but I think we could have left the paper on there and peeled it off after. Well, no, well, I'm thinking that all that body fill that was around it would have... Would well, have if we don't put that much body fill in there, we won't get it up there. So maybe just half as much, and then it'll be just right. Whatever you like. And then we'll... I'll mix up another batch, you get another piece of paper, and we'll work our way right around. Okay, okay. sounds good to me. But it, it's already 100% better than it was. And that's the first rough coat, which was about as rough as you could put it on. <laughs> and I didn't make any dust. Yes, they were, anyway, all, I could, they were all asking me if you were smoking wacky tobacco. Um, actually, tobacco, years right? ago, I smoked my fair share of marijuana and hash and stuff, but uh, I found... The last five, ten years, I've shied away from it. I'm, I'm like I'm high all the time anyway. 
honest. I oh, smoke dope. Using... You can't even carry a conversation with me. <laughs> I just woo. <laughs> what? Okay, all mix up. Oh yeah. <laughs> Well done. Put some more on. Let's go from there. Beautiful, isn't it, baby? Not as beautiful as you, but it's beautiful. Did my mic freak up? No, did it? You still got power there, is there? I'll have to try that, Jimbo. Well, Mix I was taught slower. if you flop it, you fill it full of air, which is pinholes. And if you work it, work the air out. Never flop it, like. I'm a bad flopper. I just pound. Yeah, I know, and I've seen all your pinhole. I don't <laughs> usually get pinhole. I'm not criticizing you, because you do a hell of a lot more of it than I do. No, nope, I'm just. Oh, that's not big enough. Well, that's. I'm just going to do one oh, spot. Oh, okay. We're do another piece of paper. So give me a little bit there. Give me how much ever you think you're going to split it up equally, or just give me a little bit, and then I'll lay another piece down. You can do another piece. That should be good for now. One more. One more. Okay, oh, let, that's, let me. that's all you need there. And I'm going to do this place right here. Cool. Uh, do it as fast as you can because yeah. I may have, I think I put too much hardener in it. That's all right, Jimbo. And leave the paper right there. I'll rip off another piece. Good thing you brought the whole roll. Just for you, Jimbo. Here, I'll get her, buddy. I'll get her. Oh. Go for it. What's that, sweetheart? Yep. There you go. Got more fill coming? We didn't need it. Oh, I just mixed up another batch. That's okay. I'm not scared of you. We'll put another piece of paper down. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you're only halfway through. Well, Three quarters away. You're going to put more on. Okay. That'll be good. That'll be fantastic. Boy, you making this day pretty worthwhile for me. Good. 
after changing those tires for days with tire irons. And you changed the tires with tire irons? Yes, and took the rusty one, the old rusty wheels and the seized on tires. I took them apart in the doorway where I had the door post cut away with one of those power jacks or hand bumper jacks. Yes. And broke the tire down. Then I used tire irons, took it apart, and had to weld holes in the rims because they were so badly rusted out. But anyway, um, I had a, oh, a lot of, I didn't want to spend any money, so I didn't buy any tubes, and I had a whole bunch of tube patches, so I used a whole tube of uh, glue, putting on 16 patches. You like all, glue, don't you? Oh, not really, but it, it's, <laughs> it works in some spots, but anyway, my tires now have been up in the air for a week, so I'm happy about that. You, you've accomplished what you need to get done. Yeah, and... And then, anyway, after the ordeal of these tires, I slept for three days. <laughs> <laughs> then I woke up and then two, yesterday moved all those engine parts and then you showed up. Now, we're up to date now. We're up to date now. Oh, when you take it off. Jeez, it stays right on. The, it doesn't stay on the paper, does it? No, that's what the wax almost, paper's all about. Almost none on that paper. Now I'm just taking, I'm just going to throw that right there. You want this or? No, I'm just going to smooth up my finger a little bit. You don't have to worry too much about the finger grooves. I get that a little bit with the paper, with the sandpaper. Yeah. Matter of fact, just following the flow of the natural roughness of it will make that rhythm anyway. That rhythm. Yeah, they got a rhythm. Oh, the wheel from turning. Yeah, that'd be yeah, those little glue specky things coming out. Uh, you just can't stay away from that body fill wherever you go. Yeah, I gotta be into it, right? Yep. Yeah. Oh, it's starting to. No. Yeah, it's starting to dry. What? Spot that's not touched. Over here. Oh, there's probably a few. Yeah. I'm gonna leave Wonderful. it be. I'll leave it be and then you yep. can sand it when it's dry. Well, the... Yeah. Yep. Hey, Jimbo, I'm going to get some on there. Ah! Got her's a lot of things on, but we got her. It's nice that the wheel turns, but at times it's a drag, you know, when you're trying to do that and it's turning. There. Well, the wax paper definitely got the stuff on there easier than scooping it on. Yeah. Go from oh, there. no, I'm not going to touch it. <laughs> cool. Mm. Ba, 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 ba. Like Jimbo said, I can't stay out of it. That's definitely how to get it on there, though. Yep. You know, get it in there and squeeze it in amongst all the cracks. Definitely how to get yep. it on, isn't it? Yep. And I like the way when you peel the paper off, there's hardly any on it. Most yeah. of it stays where you put it. It's good. So the brakes. Um, so you're just going to pull it up and just start going at the brakes area after, like play yep. with it for a bit? Yeah, cool. I got to break, I got to um, take my MERS brake cables off and soak them, see if I can unfreeze them and, and run all my brake lines. But I, that brake assembly, I got off that 54. Yeah. Um, up at Murphy's Junkyard, they had a 50, uh, like an old junked one. Yeah. And I was able to rip the floor. The floor was gone. I reached down with my ridges and got that arm. Good. That goes on the pedal to the master brake cylinder. So, awesome. And I bought a new master brake cylinder um, for manual brakes. And so. Good. 
Uh, you changed the wheels with just tire irons? Yeah. And, wow, that yeah. must have been hard. No, these old tires are doable. You can't do that with today's tires. But these are, that's by supply tire. But yeah, it, it um, not only that, but I had one tire, I had to take off the rim twice because I had a pinhole in it. The tube was leaking. Hours later, it was flat, and I had to take the tire off the rim, pull the tube out, patch it, put it back in, and damn thing, I missed a hole. And I had to take it back off and take the tire off the rim again, and I finally got it, but um, the rims are really rusty. Um, it's kind of for now, like if if the car goes on the road. Them tires would pass inspection, wouldn't yes, they? Yes, they're like new. There's a, a couple little cracks in, uh, by the white wall, but. The Queen's the got a crack, we don't talk about her. But the, um, the they do need balancing. When I put one on, it's just spun right around. Like, but I'm not on the road for quite a while. <laughs> yeah. <You know. laughs> I guess but. whatever you're missing now in body fill, you can put it on with your finger in little dabs. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. But I'm I'm not in any hurry to put the radiator in. I'll let this one kind of leak. A little You'll bit. have to do a video on that just yeah. to show how yes. it's done or yes. how you do it. Yeah. Is your arm tired, sweetheart? Wow. She's amazing. Are we pulling it back in, Jimbo, or you want to pull it back in? You want to let it dry for a little bit longer? Um, oh, it, I shouldn't actually have any trouble putting it in. We've heard that before. Yeah. <laughs> we <laughs> want to film it to know. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, I'm going to sand this a little bit. Should you put a tire up or anything or yeah. anything to stop yeah, the wheels? Yeah, that that's what we should have did the first time. A couple tires. Because I can put it, I can grab a couple of them tires there and stick them up on there if yeah. you want, Jimbo. Uh, Empty tires. Empty tires? Empty tires with no rims. Over by the other door. Hey man, you got some aluminum slots there. Hey man, you got some aluminum slots. But if you sand your body fill when it's still moist, it takes no elbow grease. Like you don't have to work at it too hard. But boy, you let this stuff dry. Oh my lord, it comes off like cement. Now, in some shaping, you want it dry, especially if you use power tools. You know, but if you're doing it by hand, uh, you want one tire or two? Uh, yeah. One or two? Yeah. What's that mean? Yeah, yeah, one or two. <laughs> <laughs> Plus, when you sand it by, when you sand it when it's wet, you you don't have to have good paper. The paper can be just absolutely nothing. Boy, that, he did a good job putting this on. Yeah, just the natural, that's got enough finger stuff on it, just got to fill in like the loose spots, but I'm not going to worry about getting the full finger groove that was what? original. Like half that much is uh, good. Sufficient? Yeah. But anyway, just by putting it on, Makes it, it, fall, already, it, it goes it? bump, 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 and it's still there. Like it. 
What do we got? Cross country hooking up something for you, Jimbo? Or? No, that's they're working on the street, and that's where they park their truck. That's where they park the truck. They're down the road. They were up the road, and now they're down the road. Slow down and mixing my body fill a little bit. I've been getting a lot uh, of pinholes lately. Oh, you you get you can do it just as fast. Just yeah. don't flop it down. Work it out. Score circle it around and work it out. Don't flop it in. Work it out. Like uh, just get it in your mind to work out the bubbles and never never flop it over. Always slide it and circle it around and swoop it in and work it back and forth. Instead of going this way, go this way. And you have way less pinholes. Because I have a habit, I don't have pinholes in my body work. But I'm not, I don't do a fraction as much body work as you do. Well, so, that's, that's okay. But that's also, I can't mix body fill quite as quick as you do either. That's okay. <laughs> there, that's good enough for now. Oh, that. Yeah, another, just as I said, but another little bit and some finer paper. I can work that. That's almost ready, just a little bit. That's almost ready to start going finer. I agree. Oh, I got some on me. That's what happens when you get in body film, man. You get yeah. some on you. <laughs> so, oh, what did you do with the tires? I got them in there already. Oh, stand them up. Against the thing? Yeah, yeah, against the door. Stand them up. I was thinking I was laying down and put it underneath your wheels. You want to hit them, do you? Yeah, well, no, but if I do, they have to be standing up where the bumper is. Well, <laughs> if... All I was thinking is you were going to run your tires up against them. You jump over top of that, you're going to go through the, the you know what I mean? If you run uh, your you want me to stand them up? Yeah. Yeah. No problem. I'll stand them up. Ooh, water. That's the grill. <laughs> that yeah. was the grill. Do you want these wheels here or you want them put aside? No, they're okay. Okay. Got in your brain to shut the key off? Thanks. <laughs> Keep it in your brain, bud. No, actually, I didn't. Shut the key off. That's the first thing you want to do when you get up there. You get close to where you want to get her. Shut the key off. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to stand in here and watch him. And tell him. Oh. Jimbo. Oh, I can't see anything. Shut the key off. There. Beautiful. Well done. <clears throat> Look at that, Jimbo. You got perfect workings right there now, brother. Yep. Awesome. That was well done. Yeah, I. Practice makes perfect, is what they say, I guess. Yeah, and this leaves my opening here and area. I can get stuff moved back and forth here. Right on, man. Yeah, it started run. it ran better that time. Well, that was, was, was successful. A yep. steering wheel restoration, an engine block and moving con uh, contest, <laughs> yeah, yeah. and a driving with Jimbo. Have a good yeah. one, everybody. Well, we'll see you tomorrow.